we live in a world where we are always around people. People say it's a good sign. As a matter of fact, our modern society label every alone person as depressed. We have forgotten how to enjoy our own company. In this video, I will share with you four ideas on how to enjoy being alone, and how it will benefit your overall well-being. Number 1. Reflect. Alone is the perfect time to think about who you are, what you have done so far, and also what you want to be doing in the future. You can remain silent or listen to some good music, whatever you choose to do, reflecting when you are alone is so much rewarding. Kobe Bryant once said, I'm reflective only in the sense that I learn to move forward, I reflect with a purpose. Number 2. Change Scenery Another way to enjoy your time alone is to travel. Go on a vacation where you are not around familiar faces. Get out and enjoy your own company. Number 3. Give yourself a treat. Go watch a movie or visit a museum. Buy yourself a plate of food or a bottle of ice cream. In general, give yourself a treat. Being alone is not just for reflection and thinking. It's also for treating yourself to the best things you can afford and be proud of it. Number 4. Switch off technology. We live in a world of online communications. When you are alone, if you are holding your phone, going through social media, you are not really alone. If you want to be truly alone, turn off your phone and get a book. Being alone can benefit you on so many levels. Being alone can a time for you to restore your energy. Most especially when you are tired and stressed out by work, friends, and family. Being alone aids self-development. By setting a special just for yourself, you can think and reflect about your life, reorganize your plan and strategies, and develop critical thinking. Being alone develops self-confidence. The more you spend time with yourself, the deeper you know it, and the more comfortable you are with your strengths and weaknesses. Being alone can you appreciate and value all your relationships with others. It makes you intentional in your relationships. Being alone doesn't mean you are lonely at all. To be lonely is to strongly desire to relate and have communication with someone, but you are unable to. This can make the entire world seem frustrating. Being alone is a decision. It's about intentionally getting away from people to reflect on your life and what's to come in the future. Schedule time just for yourself and enjoy your own company. Thank you guys for watching.